With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, in this question is given that if unit vector C makes an angle pi by 3 with i cap plus j cap, then minimum and maximum value of this expression that is i cap cross j cap dot C vector are, okay, four options are given here. Okay, so let's start our question. It is given that it is a unit vector. C vector is a unit vector. So if I let's suppose, okay, let's C vector, it is equals to xi plus yj and plus zk. Suppose this is my C vector. Okay, according to question, this it is a unit vector. So magnitude of C will be equals to, it will be given by what? It will be x square plus y square plus z square whole square root this is how we find magnitude it will be equal to 1 okay so if i'll square both the sides so i can write x square plus y square plus z square it is equal to 1 okay now one more thing is also given that c is making pi by 3 angle with i plus j cap okay so now work on this process we know that if a vet two vectors are making some angle so we know that cos theta between these two vector it is given by dot product of both the vectors and product of their magnitudes this is the formula okay we know this formula so here it is given that it is making what angle it is making pi by 3 so cos pi by 3 it will be equals to dot product of both the vectors okay both the vectors in place of a and b i am having vector c is my one vector and other is i plus j so here i will write i plus j vector cap okay and dot product it with vector xi plus yj plus z k this is my vector c and in denominator i will have their magnitude so magnitude of this i plus j vector it will be root under 1 square means 1 plus 1 square is also 1 okay multiplied with this c vector magnitude it was given to us in the question that it was 1 okay because it is unit vector okay so cos pi by 3 value it is 1 upon 2 here okay it will be equals to we know how to find dot word multiply coefficient of i with i j with j and k with k so here it will be x plus y for z i am having no coefficient of k here so it will be and here upon root 2 okay so from here what i can conclude that x plus y it will be equals to root 2 upon 2 or i can say 1 upon root 2 okay this will be the value of x plus y okay now look in the question what i need to find i need to find the value of this expression let me write it here okay so i need to find the value of this particular expression okay so before finding the value let's find the value of i cross j value and then dot word it with c okay so i cross j it will be i cross j we know how to find this okay it will be i cap j cap and here i will write k cap okay consider this i is one vector so here one coefficient of i is one and j and k is 0 similarly 0 and for one j vector this vector i will have 1 here and 0 here okay now solve this like we solve our determinant here okay so it will be i cap here 0 minus 0 minus j cap here it will be again 0 minus 0 and plus for k cap here i will have 1 minus 0 okay so its value i cross j value let me write here i cross j its value will be k cap only okay so let's put it back here okay this is value here so it will be k cap dot word with c vector okay put the values here it will be k cap and dot word c vector is xi plus yj plus zk okay this is why this is my c vector okay now we know how to find dot word so its value expression value let me write the whole expression again okay this value it will be equals to only z here okay this will be the value of this expression that is z so means we need to find the value of this expression which is equals to z okay so basically what i wanted to say we just need to find the value of z okay now look here we were having two equations okay it was given that x square plus y square plus z square is 1 and we have also concluded that x plus y is equals to 1 upon root 2 let me write these equation here here okay so look here these were the two equations okay this is saying that square of all the coefficient that is x y and z will be equal to 1 
and this is saying that sum of only 2 x and y not square only x and y it will be equal to 1 upon root 2 so if i want that this condition okay this condition to be true here and with respect to this also with respect to this condition also then what would be the value of x and y here? x and y should be equals to 1 upon 2 root 2 okay if this condition if this is true then only this equation will hold and similarly this equation will also hold okay so let's put the value of x and y here in this equation and get the value of z here okay so x square means 1 upon 2 root 2 whole square plus y square means similarly 1 upon 2 root 2 whole square plus z square it is equal to 1 it is given to us in the question so it will be 1 upon 2 root 2 square that will be 8 plus 1 upon 8 plus z square it will be equal to 1 okay so from here value of z square it will be equal to i'm skipping this part this is just basic calculation so this will be 3 upon 4 okay so what will be the value of z z value it will be equals to i will add plus minus here 3 by sorry root 3 by 4 here or i can say what will be the value of z it will be equals to plus minus root 3 4 root 4 can be written as root 2 so this will be the value of z and what was value of z z was this values expression okay so we need to find the minimum and maximum of this expression which was equal to z it will be minus 3 by 2 sorry root 3 by 2 and plus of root 3 by 2 let's match it with option option 2 is correct answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today